So thank you very much and thank you for this opportunity for me to share in terms of the progress we are making in Zambia. My name is Victor Mkonka. I am the director for the Zambia National Public Health Institute in Zambia, which is responsible for our health security. I am also the coordinator for the Southern Africa Regional Collaborating Center under the Africa CDC. So with the three slides, uh, I just want to share with you quickly in terms of the progress we are making. That slide is added just to show you where Zambia is, for some of you may not uh, know, and in terms of our, how we distributed with 10 provinces and 120 districts. So in terms of the progress as a country, I think we are very lucky, one of the few countries where we have received the high level pol political commitment and the will. You can see in, in this meeting we have representation from the office of the vice president and that's where we have anchored the ending cholera in Zambia. Secondly, as a country we took a policy decision, established the Zambia National Public Health Institute, which is providing the lead in the health security and ending cholera is one of the key uh, activity and intervention we are also hosting the Africa CDC Regional Collaborating Center. So we're also looking at the dimension of uh, fighting it as a region. So the Institute has coordinated in terms of the last big cholera outbreak we had using the incident management system strategy and also improved on the wash during the outbreak. We also did a huge campaign over 1.2 million uh, for OCV. Uh, the good part about it, because of the political engagement into it, the last cholera outbreak, 92% of the resources to fight it came from government, or local or domestic. Uh, since then, we've had, again, two short uh, periods in terms of cholera outbreak, which we've managed very quickly in a short time. We also provided the legal framework, particularly the Public Health Act, which allowed us extra measures to control the outbreak. And then as a nation, we have come together on a very big campaign we are calling Keep Zambia Clean, Green and Healthy, which brings in all the players from the government line ministries, private sector, uh, in a mouth sector or manner. The country perspective, as we look at uh, ending cholera, again, the target is reducing morbidity mortality and eventually eliminate cholera. For us, we are looking at the 2025. So key to, to that is enhancing our epidemiological and laboratory surveillance, which is anchored in the National Public Health Institute. Also having an effective coordination arm for the cholera elimination, which is anchored now under the office of the Vice President. And we are using the instant management system to quickly respond to outbreaks. Our head of state has made a commitment to the nation that is going to upgrade in terms of the slums. The government is going to invest heavily, particularly to improve on the issue of safe water supply and sanitation, which is very good news for, for our fight. And has agreed to be the champion for, for, for ending cholera. The other key part, I think, is on community engagement particularly as we look at uh, behavior change. And lastly, of course, is the uh, conducting of OCV campaigns in identified hotspots. So this is what we have crafted also in our uh, national strategic plan to end cholera. In terms of support we need from uh, GTFCC, the biggest, I think, is to help us supplement on the domestic allocation of the resources, I think in mobilizing the resources we need to fully implement our plan. And secondly, there are a number of areas who still need the technical support, particularly as we are strengthening our enforcement for, for surveillance. We've done very well on the indicator-based surveillance, but now we've moved also in developing the event-based surveillance. I think we need a, a bit of support in that area on the laboratory particularly the link between lab and the, and the surveillance officers. Then in the research, there are some questions, things we still don't understand about cholera. Monitoring evaluation, the hotspots. 
and then the other of course is a quick access to OCV. Um, the three slides I'm, I'm given, I think I've done in a, so during the last World Health Assembly, that's last slide just to indicate that uh, we are privileged, our minister, the two ministers from Office of the Vice President and ours with the Deputy Director General for WHO, we launched our national multi-sectoral elimination plan. So we're in the mood for the implementation. Thank you very much.